Let me know when we're rolling. You're rolling. Uh, welcome everybody to the, what, what's the name of the channel again? DZR. DZR. Welcome to the DZR Racing Channel. Uh, my name is Jacob and this is my 1941 Plymouth. Uh, I got this at a classic car dealership up in Pennsylvania. And uh, today we are going to be doing a repair on the master cylinder. Uh, the brakes have gone out and so we are going to get this girl back on the road. So, first off, we pop the hood. <laughs> This is also going to turn into a little bit of a series over time since there are no good YouTube videos out there. Uh, if you want to call this a good YouTube video. That's questionable at the moment. Yes. <laughs> um, but there are no videos on how to maintain these puppies. And so uh, if you'll come over here so we can show everybody what exactly we're working on. So, down here, trying to get it. I don't know how well they can see. I'll try to come up here a little bit. Down here is the master cylinder. Uh, you can't see it because it's steering column, but that is what regulates the brake fluid to all the various wheel cylinders and gets the start from car to stop. So, that's getting swapped out today. I got a new master cylinder from uh, Andy Birnbaum Auto Parts at oldmoparts.com. Please sponsor me. Um, <laughs> and uh, great reproduction. Let's get to work. All right. And hey, Michael, uh, are you rolling? Yeah. Bring me a uh, the fabled ten millimeter wrench. Are you really going for the ten mil on this car? What? This is an American car. Yeah. You think we use millimeter measurements in the forties? Uh, sure. Uh, <laughs> Michael, bring me the wrench, the width of a cigarette. <laughs> yes. Just bring it over here. Driver's side. Over. Yeah. Come on, Michael. You can do it. Not the hood. Why are we going to slide it from the front? Maybe why are we doing that? Crap. Go about three sizes larger. So, 13. We'll make the millimeters work, right? What's that? We'll make millimeters work, right? Uh, I tried saying that with my legs. So, future videos, we'll be uh, fixing the gaskets on this car. Yeah, show how wet um, it is. Yeah, so we are leaking various fluids. Uh, All the fluids. Yes. Uh, we have engine oil. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm still yet to figure out what this is. Um, Just random tube. Yes, tube. Uh, insert the meme here, editor. Um, <laughs> Aren't you the editor? Maybe I should do some research on this editing stuff. <laughs> a 13! What about just like the humans in Tom and Jerry where you only see the body and not the head? Measure clearly on the. If you are a loved one, have been diagnosed with mesothelium. Uh, two more sizes. So 15. Yes, bring a 15. Just bring all the wrenches. Yeah, bring all. 
<laughs> Are you bringing the whole tool chest? Hold, please. Ooh. Ooh. Here, bring the camera over here. Okay. A genuine 1941 rubber gasket. <coughs> that is the problems we are getting. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hey! <laughs> Was it a 15? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you're fired. Okay. Would you like the penetration lube? Yes. This thing's probably filled with brake fluid, and I am directly. <laughs> 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 and there's no good way to catch this. Uh, we can put a pan on your belly, or we can put some safety glasses on you. Yeah, Michael, bring the safety glasses. See, this is why I wanted a flashlight because I'm using an iPhone 14 <laughs> <laughs> as lights. Yeah, flexing much, huh? Maybe over here? Or maybe you should get a phone case for the flex. Oh yeah, and that's definitely gonna protect it from brake fluid. Well, at least you can set it on the ground and it not uh, scratch. I don't need any. <laughs> That's too big. That's too big. That's too big. <laughs> Do you, you still going to try to use it? Do we have the roll of paper towels ready? So, a little update, I am now currently blinded by my own light. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... I was starting to take it off of the frame <laughs> when I remembered, oh yeah, it kind of helps if I disconnect the, uh, all the lines. So, let me figure out where everything goes. Uh, I think that goes up to the brake pedal. Remember kids, don't try this at home. We are what nobody calls professionals. Remember idiots, do this at home. You have a very small exhaust. <laughs> It's not about the size of the exhaust, it's how you use it. I mean, sure. How kid friendly are we making these videos? Not at all. Okay. Fuck it, cunt bitch. <laughs> this man's about to get us banned from YouTube before we even take off. Wait, <laughs> wait, Oh, yeah, do you want to speed it on any percent? Get banned from YouTube. <laughs> Crystal 14. Oh, yeah, I forgot about mine. We ain't got to worry about that for a while. Ma, ma, I can't even say the word. M -m 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 money. I don't think they can see the wrenches, they just see, they just hear noise. Oh, they know what it is about the noise. <laughs> Good? Oh, <laughs> it's under your head. It's literally under your head. Yeah, there it Back is. of your neck. Yeah. None of these are the right size. You're fired. <laughs> what size do you need? 14. Wait, is it my chest? 14. <laughs> um, can you disconnect anything else? So what have you disconnected so far? Well, nothing yet. So 
this line running back here that goes to God knows me, <coughs> um, that needs to come out. So if we bring the new master cylinder. <laughs> <laughs> There's not enough space. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This is 14. So this is going to be a long YouTube video, guys. So if you need to pour your whiskey, right now we're just trying to find the right size. Of... Hey, Kenzie. Yeah. There is holes here. <laughs> Your Josh is a little rusty. <laughs> well, that's another video. Hey, it, it's coming out anyways. But it, the exhaust is still leaving the engine. It's oh. fine. Don't tell me this is a fault. So guys, what we are currently doing. The master cylinder is sitting on the frame like this. So here's the frame sitting on there. There is a uh, nut on the outlet valve I am currently trying to loosen. And that is what I need the 14 for. I haven't gotten to this part yet. That's a uh, very near future me problem. And then there are the two bolts. I'm trying to teach you two people. And then there are the two bolts down here that I also have to loosen to actually get it off the frame. So, finally, someone with mental cutlery confidence. <clears throat> hey, guess what? What? It's too big. <laughs> That's what she said. Well, you we have every ranch we own next to you, so. What? We have every ranch we own next to you. I, I even dropped the fractional ones. They're imperial, thank you. I dropped the Imperial, 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 um, uh, Dead Star. That's all, folks. <laughs> Get the penetrative fluids. Penetrative fluids. Activate. Penetration? I love penetration. Is it this? Yeah. <laughs> I can't see now. <laughs> Every single bolt on this vehicle is ugga dugga don. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, close your mouth. <laughs> Because the wrench was slipping off the bolt. Well, I don't know if that's going to help anything. Well, no, it, it's on there so tight. Thirteen. Don't tell me you lost the fourteen. Try some of the imperial sizes too. They might fit better. Yeah. What's the imperial size of it? Basically the fractions. Uh, 11, 18, 7 eighths. He knows what imperial is. He just wants to know which one is closest to 14. 13. 13. <laughs> he just drives the boy. I cannot speak. It is not one with the car. I'll get the blood toy. <laughs> yeah, we're using the wrong wrong measuring system. Alright, so keep the 13 and grab all the Imperial ones over there next to you. Imperials. The ones with the fractions. So we have real crew, you have to Hey, first try! Okay, slightly larger. What size is it? One half. Okay. So 
it's a doi made of one third? Is that <laughs> no, <thing>? that's smaller. <laughs> Two thirds? That's way too big. You're going like a 13 sixteenths. <laughs> There's 11 So that's one size smaller than half. Wait. No, it should be fine. I'm sorry, good question. Your knowledge, too. <laughs> half of 16. I didn't pass my ass class. Half no, 11 16 should be pretty good. Yeah. Half of 16 is uh, 8. This is way too big. That's what she said. How much you want to bet? Bet on what? Bet you on, bet you on this car. Kenzie, it is larger than the tube that this bolt is being. I'm glad, okay, I brought, so I'm glad I brought the face shield. Nine sixteenths. Okay, this is more like the same. I can't see shit. Still too big. Here, hand me the two big ones so we get them out of the pack. Okay, there's 13. Thanks for handing. Too big. Well, he needs to keep 13. Okay. Too big. Imagine if we have like one, one series for actual things and stuff. Now the series is just all the outtakes. Too, too big, too big, too big, too big, too small, too big. Too big. I need to turn. The camera loves this. I mean, it's interesting. Yeah. I'm talking about his back. This looks like So should we worry about copyright music? Where's my hat? That's gonna save you. Hmm? What are we talking about? Look how his head's gonna save him. 816. That's what I need. The 916 is too big. This is too small. Jacob? Yeah. 816 is one half. <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 what is between one half and nine sixteen? Nothing. No, it was a thirty second. Um, what's half of thirty two? Half of thirty two is sixteen. That makes sense. Okay, so you need a <laughs> seventeen thirty second. <laughs> Do they even make those? Yeah. Yeah. Do we have them? I don't know. Are, are you sure you don't want to try the adjustable wrench? <laughs> yeah. You know what? Look, I work on Japanese cars, okay? Give me the uh, adjustable wrench. Where is it? <coughs> oh. Come back here. I didn't mean it. I'll throw you away later. I love you, baby. <laughs> what are you doing, step car? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Don't make me drop this jack stain. <laughs> I'm spinning it the wrong way. This is so stiff. That's what she said. Get the lube. Get the lube. I should probably do it like this. <laughs> that wouldn't have been as funny. Well, Disclaimer to the audience. Oh, yeah. You get an experience of life. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> My previous comment? What are you doing, step car? <laughs> Who 
ever said that these things are easier to work on. <laughs> <laughs> we have lost light. Hold, please. Ow, my eyeballs. So are you filming now? Yep. Okay. Bitch uh, fuck cunt. Well, I am a different person now. Hello. <laughs> As you see, ear and hair. Well, maybe back up a little bit. But the bolt, bolt real stuck, so we're trying to clean it. <laughs> Because uh, maybe that'll do something, right? When in doubt, bang repeatedly. Mm -hmm. Oh, where'd the hatchet strings go? What? I need my hatchet strings. I don't know what it was. 11 sixteenths. Uh, 14, 9 sixteenths. Okay. I can't promise you how much brake fluid is actually in the system. Uh, that's true. So you might get splashed. Well, more like just seats out instead of. Russian I'm not even seeing any content other than get the side of Kenzie's head and his shoulder. Well, maybe you should move the camera. To where? Somewhere else. Oh, yeah, that one's Yo, one storm, I three. Yeah. Yeah, we need some flare nuts so it doesn't strip it. Alright. Okay. So, well, so this will conclude part one of the replacement of the master cylinder. Uh, ending in failure. What's that? Ending in failure. It's, so this not was, it's not exactly failure. It is progress. We know we need a head pitch clear wrench. Yes. Uh, so... Sometime, uh, probably next couple days, we'll head out to the auto parts store and we'll be making a part two. Hopefully, we'll get some work with that. And, um, I mean, it's probably just going to be the same video. What's that? It's probably just going to be the same video. And we might as well make it parts. Okay. And better for the YouTube algorithm. <laughs> um, I'm already worrying about the algorithm. <laughs> All right, now you get to see me cover myself in the greaser. Yummy. Ooh, yeah. Scrub it. Eh, it tastes terrible. <laughs> we can see it. <laughs> How's this sound? This is not fun. Oh, but it's working. We can <coughs> we can see stuff from up here. Let me get a real face cam. Taste a uh, good vintage. How does uh, the forties taste? Smoky. Good vintage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Does it have a mustard taste? They had a very warm winter. <laughs> Late harvest. <laughs> Got a little spicy kick to it. <laughs> <laughs> Well, do you want to give him an overview of the car while I'm sitting here suffering? What's that? You want to go walk around and give him an overview of the car while I'm suffering? Well, this is on the charger. Well, well you can stand that's up. That's why you're in the camera. Come on. Okay. Stand up and try to keep it. Yeah.
Um, this is the highest quality YouTube content right here. All right, so to give you guys an overview of the car, the car has uh, was built with a 201 cubic inch uh, six cylinder inline uh, engine, generating 87 horsepower. Now this car- How much horsepower is that? 87. I mean, a lot or a little? Yes. Yes. Now, uh, this car was one of the very first automobiles designed for interstate travel, and it was designed to have a cruising speed of 65 miles an hour. Um, but then World War II, World War II uh, broke out and well, we entered World War II and all automobile production stopped and the interstate system was put on a hold and it wasn't restarted until Eisenhower took office. Now, this car has its original paint and chrome from 1941. Uh, it has 79,000 miles. Uh, if you wanna come over here. I'm touched by cable that's gonna wrap this car. Well then go around the Montage. What? Can they say hi? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at the inside of the car now. What? What did you say? I told him we're, we're taking a look at the inside. I thought you said you were starting the car. Like, oh! <laughs> I don't have the keys on me. I have the keys on me. What? So the interior upholstery was restored two years ago by its previous owner. For people watching, what's that? Uh, over there, you have the window controls on the top. On the bottom, you have an ashtray. Yeah, yeah. And uh, this really concludes the overview of the 41 Plymouth. In later videos, uh, as we're driving along, you'll get to see more. Okay, I'll see y'all in the next video. Goodbye.